Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word, and the Daily Prophetic Word for Thursday, the 5th of December 2019 is My Narrow Pass. Why are you walking on the broad and widened path when I have commanded you to take your cross and follow me on the narrow and righteous way? This narrow path is not found in the world or in your churches. It is a heavenly path that you can only walk when you separate yourself completely from the world. My narrow path. On my narrow path you will find no worldly pleasures, careers, riches or worldly honors. It is a path through the wilderness in purity and holiness. Follow the example of the Israelites who came out of Egypt in the Exodus and come out of the world. A new Pharaoh, the Antichrist, is ready to rise and if you remain in Egypt you will die. My narrow path. My path is not the path of business, careers, temptations, or worldly riches. Instead, it is a path of prayer, obedience, repentance, and sacrifice. Only this narrow path will lead to my holy mountain, and whosoever wants to walk it must denounce the worldly system of the Antichrist and embrace me and my heavenly kingdom alone. And this was a daily prophetic word given by the Holy Spirit for Thursday, the 5th of December, 2019. My narrow pass. It's like crossing a bridge to a different site, completely separated by a strong river, a flood. The enemy cannot cross over. But you, saved by grace through faith, are now ready to walk over that bridge, in full repentance and in obedience to the Lord, ready to do the righteous deeds of the saints, so, at the end, so that at the end of your life, and in front of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and in front of our Holy Father, you might be judged according to your good works. This is what is written in the Bible. If you remain on the wrong side, in the world, you will be subjected to the new Pharaoh, the Antichrist, and his mark. And you have only one choice, at least, to save your eternal life, and that is to refuse the mark and to die as a martyr. But if you cross this bridge and you walk that narrow path and you enter into the dwelling places of Zion, the lights that the Lord is lighting up right now in all the nations, then you will be separated from the Antichrist, from the world. And you will be together with like-minded people in love, unity and support. And you will be protected by our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ by day and by night. The enemy cannot reach you. And you will have all the provision you need, even in the worst situations. So do not fear, but separate yourself from the world and from Babylon. And do not listen to the false prophets who want to lull you into sleep by saying, Oh, God has said you should enter your businesses. You should do worldly things and he will bless you. He never said that. He always said, do the heavenly things first and then the rest will follow. But most people have only sense for the worldly temptations. They only want to do worldly things. They do not want to come out of their old lives. Just imagine the Israelites at the time of the Exodus would have been like that. They would have remained in Egypt. After Moses has left with the people to walk on that narrow and righteous path, they would have remained in Egypt and Pharaoh would have killed them very badly. Now the same will happen to you if you do not walk that narrow path. You will be subjected to the Antichrist and he will kill you. Or you will accept his mark and then you will be lost forever and ever. So separate yourself from this world. The time of the great escape of the bride is at hand. 
the access to the, to the holy place, to heaven, to meet Jesus Christ every day in the spirit is prepared. You only have to say, yes, Lord, I am your bride and walk over this bridge onto the right side, the side of heaven. Do not have any more one leg in the world and one leg in heaven, but stand firm with both legs on the heavenly side. Thank you that you have listened to this daily prophetic word. And if you need training and help, how to establish a dwelling place of Zion, or how to come out of this world, then please follow the links in the first pinned comments. Otherwise, just send me an email to triplegrace55 at gmail.com and ask me any question or anything that I can help you with. I'm always here for you. I am Michael, founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Past Movement Foundation. And I am ready to help you to walk over this bridge. You are called, but few are chosen. Only few will walk over this bridge, but they will have their crowns already prepared in heaven. Thank you that you are here, and I hope you have learned something. And tomorrow, I know the Holy Spirit will give us another exciting word. Have a blessed day. Until tomorrow. Maranatha.